Hi everybody, hello. I took a shower before stream, Key. I gotta look and feel good. I even smell good. Can you guys smell me? I smell like cologne right now. I feel like I smell pretty good. I actually am a little afraid of this candle right now. <laughs> I don't know how to... Uh... Hi everybody, I smell single. Uh, yeah, hi everybody. I look tired. That's really nice to hear. <laughs> that's, that's pleasant to hear. I don't really feel tired. I feel a little tired, I guess. Hi, Daisy. Greetings. Hi, hi everybody. Let's see who is here. Tatio. Uh, healthy. Chloe. DJ. Yeah, no, it makes a lot of sense. Yesterday was a lot of compliments. Totally understandable. Today, today should be to balance it out. Insults. I think it's, I think it's fair. You know, I, I think it's a very fair way of doing it. Yin and yang, you know, even out the scales. Hello, Tiffany. Hi, everybody. Hello, hello. Greetings currently getting myself situated and ready to be talking oh you didn't insult me you're good i i didn't take it as an insult i feel a little tired um my sleep schedule is still not very good so mm. thank you key i appreciate it yeah i don't know i was kind of feeling it i saw this color when i was shopping and i was like you know what? Let's just go for it. Thank you, Healthy. I, I appreciate it. You, you definitely didn't need to end your stream for me, though. <laughs> it's still very nice. I hope it was- I hope it was good. Fair enough, Key. Yeah, I just saw it and I was like, oh, this is nice. What's up, Scoosh? Hi, Crystal. Greetings, everybody. Hello, hello. I feel that. I feel that healthy. Yeah, I'm also uh, also a little tired, but not too bad. I went to bed pretty late, and then I took a nap in the middle of the day. Uh, and I mean, I went grocery shopping today. It, it was a it was a good day for me. I think in terms of productivity. Hello, green greetings and salutations. Hi, Matt. Oh my God. Hi, everybody. It's really nice to see you. I am a. Uh, I am particularly excited for tonight to be playing a game with you guys. For anybody that does not know, today we're gonna be playing uh today we're gonna be playing Left 4 Dead 2, which I haven't played in Oh my god, at least a decade. It's been a very long time. I it's not very spooky. It 
maybe it was spooky at the time, but like, not really anymore. It, it's, if you were scared by it today, I'd be very surprised. If I get scared by it tonight, I'll be very surprised. Hello, bunnies. Greetings. It scared me as a kid? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Definitely as a kid. I did get your Discord message. I literally just looked at it. So, uh, bet, Matt. I am, I am excited. I hope it is going well. I hope it's going well for you. Yeah, hi, everybody. It's really nice to see you. Greetings. Oh, and I'm even excited for tomorrow. My mother is coming to Florida tomorrow, and we're going to go out drinking and partying, and do. we're going to a karaoke bar tomorrow, which is really exciting. I don't know what the... I don't know why there's this ongoing trend of karaoke going on, going to karaoke bars. Last weekend, this... I have... I want to say I've been to a karaoke bar, like, once before this week, and apparently it's just, like, this ongoing trend. I feel like I have to go now every week. 9 to 5 in the middle of the city every day? Yeah, but I bet you're making bank, though. So, are you enjoying it? Or are you not enjoying it? Hi, DMI. Greetings. Uh, my mom will not be making appearance. I don't stream on Wednesdays. And uh, I, even if I were to be streaming tomorrow... I kind of wanted to take the day off and spend it with my mom, as well as my sister. I'm going to be seeing my sister for the first time in, like, a month or so. And, and then my mom for the first time in, like, a couple months. So, it's like a little family little family reunion going on tomorrow. So, tonight, we get to play a game together. At me, playing a video game on, on Twitch TV. Is that even, like, allowed? Will I get in trouble? There, there's a good chance that my channel gets banned for, uh, for playing a video game instead of doing a just chatting stream. <laughs> Hi, booty. Greetings. Can we get a family video hello in Discord? Uh, I will ask. I will ask. Maybe they would like to say hello. Feel like hello. Oh, no worries, gamer. Oh, my sleep schedule is so messed up. My sleep schedule is so messed up. I, I'm wondering if I should try to start, like, at one point in the middle of the stream, if I really should just take this melatonin and then just try to go to bed. I, I had this, uh, yeah, I, I just can't keep doing this to myself every single night, going to bed at, like, an obscene time, waking up at, like, five or six in the afternoon. That just, like, can't be healthy for me. At 1.30... Okay, sure. Yeah, yeah. We'll do. We'll take. We'll take uh, an extra strength melatonin at one thirty. Sure, that's a good plan. A lot of learning. What exactly are you doing, Matt? What is your job? Like, you see, that sounds very exciting for a job in the middle of the city, where you're getting good pay and you're learning. See, that sounds awesome. All right, no worries, Matt. I'll see you then. Goodbye. Goodbye. Matt said you will never know. Yeah. <laughs> oh, hello, Porthos. Greetings. Yeah, hi. Tonight we're going to be playing uh, Left 4 Dead 2. So I don't know how comfy of a game it is. To me, personally, Left 4 Dead is a pretty comfy game. Me, personally. Because I don't really think it's... I don't think it's too crazy of a game. I think it's pretty, pretty relaxed. I mean, there's a lot of, like, shooting and things going on, but... Uh, it's not particularly competitive. Yeah, it's goofy. I agree. It's pretty goofy. That That is a good word to describe it. 100%. It's com I love zombie games, so I'm excited. I, I, it will be nice to, like, change things up. I, I definitely want to play more games on stream, so this is, like, and, and in Left 4 Dead 2, like, having a flashback game, the last time I did a flashback game was... Oh, jeez. I don't even remember. <laughs> I don't do a lot of replays on stream, I guess. This will be exciting. I listen to s streams to fall asleep. So comfy. Yeah, fair enough. 
I mean, wouldn't couldn't you consider couldn't you consider any stream in which you feel comfortable in to be a comfy stream? No. I guess some streams are like <laughs> like mm, I only watch streams if I feel comfortable in watching them, but that's just me. You know, I, I would never watch somebody that like specifically I would never watch a streamer that aggravates me, that irritates me. Because what am I what would I why? Why would I do that to myself? I played Back for Blood. Yeah, I am really looking forward to Back for Blood. I cannot wait until Back for Blood is finally released. I have it pre-ordered and everything. It will be a really good time. I watch some streamers and they are loud and have too much energy, but this is chill and laid back. Oh, 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 you're saying I'm quiet and exhausted. Yeah, yeah, that is, uh... <laughs> Uh, I am a little, no, I'm, I'm joking with you. I'm joking with you. I, I am a little tired, but it depends. It depends on my mood. Ever since I've messed up, ever since I've been going to bed so late, my energy has definitely been decreased. So at 1.30, around 1 to 1.30 AM, we're going to take the extra strength melatonin and we're going to see what happens. I'm already showered, my teeth are brushed. Essentially, I am ready for bed. I just put on some PJs and a t-shirt and I'm ready to go, so. It needs to be the right mood. I like it here, I could start having a mental breakdown and crying and I'd be good here. What if I started crying and have a mental breakdown? Would I be good here? <laughs> I don't... How well would that go for me? See, now it definitely is like a one-sided thing, right? How is that? How is that fair? How is it that... How is it that that you guys, as a community, could cry and have a mental breakdown? Why is it a viewer can cry and have a mental breakdown in the stream, but when the streamer does it, it's like, oh my god. <laughs> I want to see that good content. Uh, it would take a lot, honestly. I don't know, I don't exactly know what it would take for me to start crying. Like, legit, and I mean, like, actual feelings, sadness crying. That would, be, that would, that would I would have to muster a lot of energy for that. <laughs> You're, like You're ugly. That's, that wouldn't do it for me. I, I would need to get, like, a... Yeah, if I watched a bunch of videos that were really sad, then I think I could. Yeah, like, beginning of up kind of thing. Yeah, if I watched that, I'd probably cry. That is true. What's up, Bambi? Thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. Who followed? Uh, Bambi and Suzanne. Thank you guys for the follow. It's welcome. Can we have a cozy cry stream? I really don't want to make content out of my hysterics. <laughs> uh, I can forcibly make myself cry on demand for content, I guess. Like, you guys know that. Like, so, people that know me know that I can just cry on demand if I feel like it, but I don't know why I would want to. <laughs> yeah. It would definitely, it would definitely somber my mood. Do you need a hug? Yeah, I would say yeah. There's, why not? Weighted blankets, hot cocoa. Yeah, I don't have that. I have tea and, um... Lily, that is currently uh, waiting for me to give her a treat. Hello, Hilarious. Greetings. Thanks for the hug, Calvin. <laughs> I, didn't, I forgot we even had that command. Spill the tea. Really, I really don't want to. I, I would, you know, I would spill the tea. Just... I don't want to clean it up.
I don't want to clean it up. And also, I'm really enjoying this tea. I just put good honey in it, too. I agree. I would cry if you spilled the tea. I, I would also cry, because that would mean I would have to go clean it up. Hello, Abraham? That's my Hebrew name. For anybody that doesn't know, my second name is Abraham, technically. Uh... Yeah, this is the, uh, this is the relaxation tea. Yeah, yeah. This is, a uh, lavender. Lavender and honey. And then I just put real honey in it, because it just makes it taste better. Uh, yeah, you can send me stuff to my P.O. Box, absolutely. Absolutely. Um, things that I enjoy being sent. Uh, you guys have sent me food before. Nothing that's been already opened. Your parents' credit card. I'd really appreciate that. Um, pretty much anything that you want me to open up on stream. So, and I go to my P.O. Box the, the first Friday of every month. So, the next one will be in September. Lavender and honey, I would fall asleep. Yeah, you do not understand. I don't think... You're, you're a little too new here to really understand how my brain and body works. I go to bed at like six in the morning, not because I want to, but because I, I re actually I don't have a real reason to. I just I just do. <laughs> I just I just do. I really need to stop. Actually, that's why tonight, tonight, we are going to, in perfect combination, we're going to be playing Left 4 Dead 2 with uh, the bunnies and Tatio because they have saved up seventy five thousand channel points for me to play any game that they want and they said that they wanted me to play left 4 dead 2 with them and i said absolutely and at some point i'm going to be taking a melatonin and we're going to see if i can fight through it or not maybe i'll just pass out at my desk who knows i'll send you sixty thousand dollars to your po box if someone sent sixty thousand dollars to my P.O. box. And let's assume that it was in cash. I think I would, the, the main, I think the main emotion I would have is fear. Because there's no way that somebody just in their right mind would just send $60,000 in cash. Yeah, exactly. I would assume it's drug money and I'm now being hunted by a cartel or something. Right? Like, uh, I, my friend, my friend told me this yesterday. He said, uh, he made this scenario. He was like, if someone approached you and was like, here is a million dollars, would you take it? And I, I don't think that I could. Because, th yeah, there's there's always a catch. And I don't think I want to be on the receiving end of a million dollar catch. You know? <laughs> it can't... Oh, you're chewing two melatonin gummies? Good night. I am so dangerous. Well, that's the thing. I would trust you, I guess. But... I just, I don't think you do it. I just don't think you do it. And I, and I, I don't think you should do it. <laughs> People say not to overthink is a perfect time. Exactly. Exactly. Like, there's always a catch. So, <laughs> uh, do not send, actually, I'm not even gonna say I'm not even going to say don't send $60,000 to my P.O. box, because if you do, realistically, I will open it up on stream and I will accept it. But, like, make sure if you do that it is not connected to a cartel or a mafia of some sort. So now I'm safe because I said it out loud and you've heard me and you understand 
now I am guarantee safe from any cartel or, uh, you know, drug deal gone wrong. It's, it's impossible now. E-transfer it. Yeah, wire it to me. Or just use that link. That is very true. PayPal does take a little bit of a cut, but like... I don't know, like... How much would I lose for $60,000? Like a, like a grand or two? So like, what's better? Losing like two grand or something? Or like, getting all my limbs chopped off? It's like, it's like a give or take, you know? I can't guarantee which I would choose. You'll send me 60,000 Dogecoin? Oh, I'm down for that. That is better. Because when it hits a dollar, I'm going to have five more dollars. I can buy a whole Big Mac with it. Actually, Big Macs are more than five dollars. Uh, are you sure you don't want that because things can be arranged? Maybe I should just join the Mafia. I'd have to join a Jewish Mafia, though. I don't really think any other kind of organized crime group would accept me. Being... Uh, being Jewish in terms of the organized crime community definitely limits me on where I can go. I definitely would have to join a... a, a is there a queer... Wait, 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 wait. That would be actually really cool. Is there an LGBT... Mafia? Is that like a thing? What would be a... There's gotta be a good name, a good pun of a name in there for a LGBT plus Mafia. There's gotta be, there's gotta be a good joke in there. My brain is not working at 100%, so I can't think of it, but... Isn't that what just chat is? We are... Wait, wait. No, no, no. We are not... We are a family. We're a family. Okay? And, and don't don't confuse it. I, I'm really I'm really not trying to stir up anything. The ex mafia family? No no, it's just the ex family. That's good enough. You don't need to add the word mafia in there. I'm not trying to confuse anyone, you know? The pink crime family, rainbow mafia. They're like they're like good names. But like there there's there's definitely like a there's definitely like a uh like a pun in there somewhere. I don't really know where it is. Jew Mafia, you want to be a comedian? Actually, actually, the Jewish Mafia ran New York City for quite some time. So, uh, you better not be talking smack, otherwise I'll have to call up some friends. And it, it will not end well for you. We will, uh... The gang... That's a good one. See, that's a good one. The gang. It's kind of hard to pronounce, though. It doesn't, like, sound right when you say it. But, like, it's definitely good. Like, that is... Are you guys here for Lily? That's so interesting, because I'm literally looking at her right now. And from the way that she's looking at me, it doesn't really seem like she wants anything to do with you. It's very interesting how a lot of you show up for my cat, yet my cat really has no interest in you whatsoever. It's, that is a real one-sided relationship. And I really think that you should reevaluate your, uh... I bet Lily wants five subs. I, I don't know. I, it's possible. I, I think that she wants the treat more than she wants the subs. Which I have this in, insanely large box. Mm. All cat love is one-sided until they are hungry. When they are hungry, uh, she gives me all the affection. She's on top of me. She wants, she wants pets. She wants, you know. And then I feed her. And then she ignores me doesn't want me to touch her uh 
Oh, I... <laughs> Lily definitely has me trained very well. I... I wake up every morning. Actually, that's that's not true. I, that's, a, that's actually a lie. I wake up in the afternoon. I wake up in the mid to late afternoon to Lily screaming. Like, full, full screaming in my face. The moment she understands that I'm awake, she is on my pillow next to me, screaming in my ear. For food, obviously. The first thing I do is I get out of bed to feed her because I do not want... It could go on for an hour, like hours. Your poor future kids will starve. Well, I'm hoping that by the time I actually have children, that I will have maintained a specific level of responsibility that requires me to wake up at not four in the afternoon. Now, there's no promises, but assuming that things go correctly and that i actually get a full-time job living in new york city and like i have things to do responsibilities you know then i, I it, it should not be that way <laughs> oh my god is that a compliment i think so I hope your partner is ready to raise them in you. Oh my God. Again, I said, I've always said, and I think this is a fair deal. I think it's a fair deal. You guys can argue it out. But when it comes to my future partner that I will end up living with, you know, I will do the cleaning if they do the cooking. And I think it's really fair because to be honest, you only eat like what? At, like four times a day at max you know like three meals and a snack or something but you should be cleaning pretty much every single moment like yeah it's, i think it's a very good trade so but does cooking include shopping well the shopping will be split that'll be split at all the groceries split in half you know who does the shopping that will be split or done at the same time i think it's fair Oh, that's fun. That's fun, healthy. Enjoy that. Uh, I would like to start playing our uh, our game of the night soon. Because if I'm going to be taking a melatonin within the next hour and a half, it can only end very badly for me, assuming I get ready to sleep. So, cooking together is one of the greatest joys of being in a relationship like you and Juan. Yeah, so totally. I love accidentally cutting my finger off and burning my hand on the inside of the oven. What a what a joy. What a <laughs> what a splendid way to bond. Do you really want your kids to grow up in New York City? That's a good question. Kind of in like a selfish way. Because I wish I got to grow up in New York City as a kid. It's dope. City kids are awesome. They get to experience everything that the city has to offer from like the moment they were born. So, why not? I have 10 minutes left on my crumble. Oh my god. We are waiting on your crumble to finish before we can start playing. Alright, fine. I, I will wait. I will wait. Cooking with someone else actually no, no i agree with you i i actually enjoy cooking with other people i think it's a lot of fun cooking by myself though i find to be very boring i i have a very weird mentality when it comes to i guess cooking in specific the part that aggravates me or like why i don't cook myself a lot is that cooking takes a long time like making a meal that's like an hour it's like an hour of time when it takes me about 10 seconds to open up a can of spaghettios and stick a spoon in it you know what i mean so <laughs> uh. but that being said i do enjoy good food i do enjoy homemade food 
that like love and time and sweat has been into like trust me i would rather i would rather eat your well-made dinner that you have provided for me than a can of spaghettios but i don't i don't know i just i just don't make it i don't know <laughs> no you don't have to heat them up absolutely not they taste better when you don't heat them up I, I actually, I, I'm going to try to not buy SpaghettiOs for the next <laughs> couple months. My goal is to not have to eat another can of that nonsense. And I think it's fair. You like jazz? I feel like it only damages me. SpaghettiO cleanse, yeah. A detox, one might call it. Bubbles, take the follow. I am new here. What are we chatting about? Uh, talking about the, I guess, I usually just follow whatever the trend of what other people are talking about. However, at the moment, we're talking about the, I guess, the benefits of cooking, as I'm not someone that likes to cook, but I've always said that if I were to ever get into a realistic, serious relationship, that I would do all of the cleaning while the other person would do all the cooking, because I think that's a very fair trade. And hi, Bubbles. It's nice to see you. And thank you for the biddies, too. I really appreciate it. Uh, sometimes bad food is good food. Like a late night slice of greasy pizza is almost better than anything. I actually made a pizza last night because I was really hungry. Um, usually late night food makes me feel like trash, though. Like I had a, I, I made a pizza last night, right? Right, regular it wasn't delivery it was DiGiorno's like literally and I felt like absolute shit afterwards like I was like regretting that I heated this up but I was also so hungry that and there was nothing else to eat I only cook when it's for someone else yeah that's kind of how I feel is that like cooking for myself do I really want to spend an hour in the kitchen to make something for myself that like I'm just going to enjoy and then like move on I have a maybe I have a bad mentality about it you guys, you guys are all three-star Michelin chefs, so you guys are all real foodies, which by the way, I hate that term. When somebody calls themselves a foodie, it's like, I hate that term. What, you like to spend a lot of money on food? Good for you. Uh, it's like when people say, oh, I love to travel. It's like, yeah, you mean you have the money to travel. That's what you're saying. <laughs> Everyone loves to travel. I like your new setup. I haven't been here for a while. Hi, Emily. Yeah, it's been a minute. It's been nice to see you. Yeah, I, I like this new setup, too. It feels really comfy. I even got to do a little bit of a, um, a little bit of a, a, a sh apartment tour last night that if you were not here, that really sucks because I unpublished the VOD so you won't be able to see it. You'll have to wait for the next one. Hello, quiet. Greetings and salutations. You like jazz? I work from home, so my little brother and my mom makes me food because I can't leave my desk ever. Wow, that sounds like the life. Having people just make you food for you. Chat, when are you gonna start making me food? Honestly, I'd be really, I'd be way more interested in like doing like a hangout if there's the promise that chat will make me food. Like if dinner is included, yeah, I'm there. I'm about it. What enthusiasm? Oh, you want me to be more excited? Should I, should I be more? Oh my, look, chat, look who it is. It's Quiet Riot. Holy. I feel like shit right now. Sorry to hear that. I felt like shit last night when I went to bed at 8 o'clock in the morning. And then I woke up at 5 p.m. So, uh, sorry to hear that. You gave me a heart attack. Yeah, I know. I got really excited. I got, I got really excited all for nothing. Honestly, today, my 15-year-old brother made me a homemade smoothie and some mini pizzas. Then mom bought me a chicken pot pot. What? You are living the actual life here. 
like a like a like a like royalty, like a king or queen or whatever. Why does chat not make me smoothies? Right? Like Can you imagine? And and only one of you has to do it too. It's not like it's not like all of you have to participate in making a smoothie, just like one a night. I think it's pretty evenly divided. I once found out uh Found another fractures. Uh, I'm sorry to hear that, Emily. Uh, I am here for you. So is chat. But like lavish, I mean technically a king by a lot of yeah, whatever. It, it, I say king is a is a very gender neutral term. I, I think that anybody can be king or queen. I prefer to be called queen because honestly, I think that's much better. Think about it. Think about it. In chess, the best piece is the queen. Rumble is out of the oven. Is that a is that a euphemism or like a like a riddle? So if the crumble is out of the oven, yeah, I can't figure that one out. There's not enough context. Royalty is gender neutral, and then you can hold multiple positions. Oh, really? How many positions can I hold, Quiet? No, I know what a peach oh, crumble yeah. is. My my dad would make uh, apple crumble. My dad, my mom, my mom would make apple crumble. My dad does not know how to cook. <laughs> like father, like son, I guess. Be nice, they spent their points on you. Was I mean? Have I been mean at all tonight? I feel like I've been very kind to you, if anything. I've been very generous. I've complimented you. I've comforted you in your time of need. I'm being a very valuable citizen right now. To, to the public, to the community. So, don't put me down. Gotta keep the momentum going. Oh, I know what it, I know what it is, Bunny. I know what it is, and it sounds really good. It sounds so good. Uh, I had a sandwich today. You wanna know what I ate today? That's it. That's all I had. I had a sandwich. So. I w okay. I wish y'all could smell my apartment right now. Out of context, that is a very odd sentence. Out of context. But it's in context. But I could, I'm just going to take it out of context. Alright. I just splashed tea all over my face. How long until we can start smelling things with the phone? Uh, I mean, if you smell hard enough, you may be able to smell my cologne. I smell pretty good right now. I'm not going to lie. I did. I did spill the tea. I spilled it on my face. Not, not, not intended either. I just joined as you said it completely out of context. Yeah, exactly. See, not everybody here is going to understand the context of please smell my room. Honestly, though. Would you even really want the ability to smell through a television? I'm going to say over 50% of things probably smell bad. And I mean in general. Like, yeah, if you're watching like a cooking network, right? Like you're watching Gordon Ramsay cook something or like, sure, I'd love to smell them cooking it. But like when you're watching like... I don't even know. What, what do people watch on TV nowadays? I, I don't even know. Like, would you even really want to... Actually, my room smells pretty good. You would smell blooming lilac candle and, 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 and Gucci cologne. So... Let's 
smell vision it, it just reminds me of that Futurama, that 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 Futurama episode where they develop a smelloscope. But I, I just don't think it's realistic. I just don't think it's possible. I I know that at some point, and I could be wrong, the people were working on a like a virtual reality video game in which did incorporate smell. Like it used gunpowder and it used like a bunch of different things to try to make it as realistic as possible. One of you can Google it and see if it's that's like a real thing, but I think it was. Um, I want 3D printing the food that they're making on TV. Yeah, that'd be kind of cool. You know, you know what I want, and and almost almost to the same degree that we just don't have yet. I want instant delivery. Like, you know how we talk about how like, like we, it's Skynet. You guys know about like the Skynet thing? How there's just going to be drones flying everywhere and delivering things? I just want that to be the reality. Why, why can't it? Like, we're so close. It's going to happen in our lifetime. It's going to happen. Give it, give it 20 years, 30 years. And you want something. You want, damn, I want to food you want your food delivered you want your your groceries whatever you click a button boop zip right to your house dropped it off let melatonin is almost an hour oh you're gonna fall asleep and now i have to stay up now i gotta make sure you fall asleep eight to ten years stop top you think so skynet didn't deliver food yeah but i'm not talking about actual skynet i'm talking about a drone manually delivering the thing that i wanted to my house in under an hour it's gonna happen. It's gonna be exciting too. All right, so are we ready to play Left 4 Dead? Bunnies, are you ready? As well as Tatio, are you ready? Also, are we doing a, I assume that we should do like a Discord, like a, like a mutual Discord or something. So for people that do not know what is happening tonight, like the agenda of tonight. So I have a channel reward that you're allowed to that you're allowed to make me play whatever game that you want me to play. And Bunnies saved up 75,000 points, which is a, a lot of points actually. Like that's quite a long time to save up points so that I could play Left Left 4 Dead 2 with them and to TO. So that is what we're going to be doing tonight. And I'm really excited because we haven't really done like a community game thing in a while. So this is the closest that we've done to it in a bit. So it, I, I'm, I'm kind of inspired that maybe we can do like a community game night soon. Steam group chat, the one called, yeah, 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 wait, but is there voice chat or something in that? I don't know how Steam anything works. Hello, evil. I feel bad if I leave. If you're talking about stream, definitely do not worry about that. Um, oh my God, is that Gabby? Wow, it's been like, how long has it been since you last been here? Oh, like two months. <laughs> Jeez. Jeez. Hello, Naba. Greetings. If you guys want me to say hi to you, please do say hi. Uh, we're going to be playing Left 4 Dead 2 tonight. And then uh, at some point during the middle of it, uh, some point during the middle of it, we're going to be taking a melatonin and we're going to see how long we last. Hello, queer. Greetings. I got back from Costa Rica. Wait, wait. Did you go? Did you like go to Costa Rica for like a, like a month and a half? That's crazy. That's a great vacation. Did you get that well-earned manicure or did you paint your own? Oh, I definitely painted my own nails. I don't know if you can really tell from this distance, but I'm really bad at painting my nails. So I go with the apply as much as I can onto my nail method and then get the rest of it off later. And it's wor it worked out pretty well. It worked out in my favor. I think they look okay. 
I also have never used a color this bright, but I was like, yeah, it looks kind of nice. Why not? Do you put a clear coat over it? Uh, I, no, I do not. I, I just, I just, I just put the paint. Yeah, I here here I'll go I'll, I'll go through the full steps of the process, ready? I take the paint and I put it on my nail. And then I let it dry. And then if I'm really feeling frisky, I'll put the paint again on the nail. I had to break that down for you so you understand. If you click on voice chat, it will add you the combo. All right, chat, are we ready? Are we ready? Ugh. Good night, Calvin. I appreciate you. Uh, I was saving turtles for a month. How many turtles did you save, Gabby? That's actually really noble of you. All right, so uh, I'm going to be switching things over to uh, to Left 4 Dead. So it's been a really long time since I played this game. I I don't entirely remember it. I'm hoping that when we play it, I'll kind of remember all of the old memories that I've had with it. But I'm excited. I I'm I'm really excited to be playing something with you guys. And this is like a this is like a game from my childhood, childhood. Yeah, childhood. That sounds about right. All right, let's switch this over. So, for anybody that has not played Left 4 Dead, I'll give a little explanation because some people may not even know what Left 4 Dead is. Uh, Left 4 Dead is a zombie game that was created by valve and i have no actual history of the game i only have the history that i can recall of it from like my own gameplay this game when it came out was super super popular i remember i had it for xbox 360 but it was on every console on everything looking back at this game now this game is kind of there's no real objective I I look back at the days that I did play Left 4 Dead and I was like, why were we so obsessed with this game? But I think that at the time that Left 4 Dead came out, we were really like looking for something to we were looking for like a community game, like a game that like, could really like bring your friends together. And this was an ultimate bring your friends together video game. So uh, that's kind of the experience that I'm looking for tonight. So I'm going to jump into the voice chat with bunnies and then we're going to open up the game and we're just going to go for it. Hello. 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 Greetings. Okay. You figured it out. I think Congratulations. so. Congratulations. I did. Uh, all right. I sent you the invite. I think I got to open up the game first. Yeah, good start. Good start. Oh yeah, Kyo wants to be Rochelle, so I'm not taking the one female character in this game. I... I don't even know what the characters do anymore. Report unusual They're behavior. They're the same, it's just aesthetics. Yeah. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they are just aesthetics. You even remember? When was the last time you played this? Do I want to allow it to make changes? Sure. Sure, sure, sure. I played this last week with Tio, so. All right. Uh-oh. I, oh my god. It, it the flashbacks the memories i'm getting from <laughs> looking at this menu are kind of insane beautiful huh it it it, it, it 
it really is a piece of gaming history this is a masterpiece it's something first we got to make sure that my controller even works so we can play the game that's important Oh, there is no controller integration for- oh wait, no, no, I'm wrong. I'm wrong. I have to, uh... Closed until further notice due to sickness. They, <laughs> I, I wish I could do a push to talk so you guys don't have to hear what you're at, but... No, that's- Sorry. I mean, we'd be listening to you talk to chat anyway, That so. is- that is kind of true. <laughs> um... You missed the intro to Left 4 Dead. Yeah, I kind of... I, I don't know what I... Honestly, I, I won't really feel anything until I'm in the game actually playing it. I miss I miss the old multiplayer of Left 4 Dead. Like, being able to play as the zombies and stuff against your friends. And, like, actually trying to get a... That. Yeah, that is, that is something that we definitely can... I need to open the... Can... I can play this with my controller. Warm up, we can do that after if you're still down. Or if Tatio's still awake. <laughs> I, I'm going to be taking a melatonin in about an hour, so we're gonna see we're gonna see how long I can last. Oh, wait. My controller doesn't work anymore. I'm an idiot. <laughs> uh like I accidentally spilled coffee on my controller, the only PlayStation controller that I own. And now it just does not work. So, you know, that's cool. Bye bye. We're gonna be playing mouse and keyboard. Uh thank you for the follow. Uh, Jessica, greetings. Dumbass. I, you know, I didn't, un <laughs> you see, I had a clear, okay. <laughs> if I've learned anything from playing Magic the Gathering, a children's card game for years, that one of the biggest pieces of advice I've ever learned that I've applied to my everyday life is do not keep liquids on a countertop and it's uh, it's legit like you if you were to go to a big big magic tournament thousands of people all showing up from around the world to play this game one of the first things that the person who is running the tournament the tor tournament organizer says is anybody that has a liquid on the table needs to place it on the floor and then they usually make some sort of wet cardboard joke like unless you enjoy all of your cards being an underground sea or something like that i don't know something like bad a, a joke that everybody actually intentionally cringes at uh there's no put it on the floor you have a cup of coffee assuming that you're not gonna knock it over put it on the floor <laughs> i spilled my cup of coffee and i mean i guess it i had to clean up from the floor i had to clean i my controller is ruined I got a little bit of my Pokemane mouse pad, and now that's like, that's honestly the, the MVP. I would never want that damaged, so. All right, Left 4 Dead, you're loud. I'm skipping you. So the f I'm gonna have to, you guys are gonna have to give me a second so I can re redo my keybinds because uh, I'm going, oh yeah. <laughs> Oh, yeah. How many buttons are there? Oh, not many. Okay, okay. So, forward is this. Back is this. Left is this. Right is this. Move slowly is this. Jump. Duck would be this. Fire would be this. Push away. I don't know what mouse button three is. Um, welcome back, Dominique. I kick over glasses of water all the time. Well, then don't put them where your feet are. <laughs> I'm. I. I they, they, there's really no winning. How about this? Just don't drink liquid. I think. I think if we just stop consuming liquid overall, we will never have a problem spilling, right? Up, down, last weapon. You. I'm, I'm not pressing that button. Communicate. Oh shit, okay. 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 This is this. This is this. This is this. 
This is this, and this is this. Use item. Ah, crap. Oh. Okay, I think I did it. Hi, virtually. Hello, how was your stream? It looked like you were having fun reading stories. I was lurking. Um, we're gonna cup with a lid. Yeah, that's very true. A spill-proof lid, like a like a like a child-proof cup. Uh, I have friends playing. Yeah, it looked like you were having fun. I'm currently in it. All right. So yes, I am ready. I'll do a little introduction. For anybody that doesn't know what's happening right now, I'm playing Left 4 Dead 2 with uh, Bunnies and Tatio, because Bunnies saved up 75,000 sugar channel points so that I would play a game with them. And they requested Left 4 Dead 2, which is an old classic for me. I haven't played this game in over a decade. So hopefully it goes very well and we just crush it. But no promises. He's very good at this game. He's very Are you? good at it. I, I just have fun, but... He's very good at it, so. Uh, yeah, I, I, I guess. <laughs> okay, so all the buttons work. The first step is making sure all the buttons work. Uh, hey, check it out, man. That's some Midnight Riders. I don't you know. heard of them. They any good? Hell yes. I got okay, all Okay, so you can only have one gun. And, no and one good. of them, so Best you can even have the okay. you ever ammo. Cool. I get a first aid kit. Good night, Emily. I appreciate you. Thank you guys for being here. Okay. Uh, this hits. That shoots. Hey. By the way, how's the volume for you guys in chat? Is it loud? Is it quiet? Is it perfect? Um, it's kind of loud. Okay, okay, cool. I will. Uh, it is kind of loud for me, too. Let me see if I can decrease it. Turn it to like that. I think that's fine. Game is loud. Bunnies is quiet. I think that's just because she's soft-spoken. You know? No. <laughs> no. Uh, so you you that mean I need be a little better? To... All right. I'll I'll increase your volume. I'll increase both your. All right. Cool. Didn't want to be too loud, so I probably overcompensated. But you know. Overcompensated. Than Welcome to my life. Uh. <laughs> All right, and uh, oh, by the way, somebody subscribed offline like a, a day ago, which I was gonna thank them, but now I, now it's too far in the queue and I can't remember who it was. So whoever you are, and you know who you are, thank you for that. And he wanted some beer, but they weren't giving him any, so he got this rope. Now don't ask me where he got the rope from. And sweetie, I'm ready. I ready, ready. I oh guys God. ready. Okay. Okay. Just getting impatient. Okay. Uh, me... I guess so. Are we ready? Chad, are we ready? I'm heading to bed soon. Have a good night, TJ. I appreciate you. All right. Three. How do I open it? <laughs> Did you guys just come for that? I think. Well, oh boy. Yeah. I, <laughs> oh. I don't know how you found your. Yeah, it could have been some sort of evac zone. Hello, Ellie. Greetings. Watch out! Is the buzzing in the game? Reloading. I think it's, uh... Okay, this game is actually very loud. <laughs> I think it's... I, hear a I think it's bugs. I'm pretty sure it's bugs. Really? Okay, okay. Who the hell do you think you're shooting? Reloading. All right. Let's see if I do this. Tell me if this decreases it. If I do that, now the game volume should be very low. But did that decrease the buzzing for you? Grabbing the pistol. Oh yeah, they were the in-game cicadas are apparently. Oh. What a horrible idea. 
Why did you guys not play the new version in beta? Uh, I didn't get to play the beta. I didn't really have the time to, but I did watch a bunch of people play it, and it looked really good. I have no recollection of this map in the slightest. This is my favorite map. I know this one. Also, watch out behind you. No worries, Ellie. I appreciate you. Could go up a bit and be tolerable. Yeah, what the hell? Wait, let me see if I can let me see if I can adjust the cicada. Is there a cicada level? Uh, no, it doesn't really. Yeah, stop being a liability. This is great. I love it. Is this Call of Duty Zombies? This is Minecraft, actually. This is the new Minecraft update. Pretty realistic. A little more gory. They made it a little more adult. Reloading. Oh my god. Modded Minecraft, yeah, for real. <laughs> look, at, look at the realist. Ammo. Look at the look at the graphics on these guns. I thought this was Roblox. That that would actually be more on brand for me is to be playing Roblox. That is, that is true. Is there like any reason to be exploring any of this? Oh shit. Mom! Mom! Oh shit. Because I wanted to explore, okay? What is that sound? Why does it say don't shoot teammates? Does, does that do any, Does that do any damage? Wait, that deals damage to you? No, it doesn't. Are you really gonna shoot again? No, it doesn't. Nothing is happening. You hear my character saying you shot me? Yes, I hear your character saying it, but I'm not losing any health. We're playing on the easiest difficulty. What's up, Key? I wonder if Tyler can solo run this like Call of Duty Zombies. Yeah, I guarantee. I could probably speed run it. Honestly, I'm I'm an absolute master when it comes to any zombie game. Uh, go here. Oh. <laughs> Get melee weapon. I really don't want that though. It's not nice to shoot friends. Sometimes it is. In this situation, it's definitely. Do I have to? So cute. So cute. Here. Oh, yeah. Here. Do melatonin work well for you? Uh, we're gonna find out tonight. Together. Hand in hand. Oh, the hunter was always my favorite to play as, as a zombie. The, the hunter and the liquor. Those were like... The liquor. Is that what they're called? What are they called? What's the smoker. one? The one with the tongue? Oh, so. smoker. Okay, I don't know. What a horrible name. The entire the entire mechanic of that zombie is based around how long its tongue is and how it grabs you. They call it a smoker. Wait, am I wrong? I think you're right. I have some essential oils that work well with sweet sleep. Is it is it like weed? That'd definitely be a good oil. I'll definitely help you sleep. Reloading! And Tio, they're just all over you today. Yeah, I'm getting lucky. Oh my god. What's up, bud? How you do? You look ain't. Oh my! You look so pissed. Cause you're stalling. He's like, get on with it, man. Nigga, <laughs> I thought you knew how to use a gun. I do. <laughs> Imagine bullying, coach. Yeah, what? What a, what a dick. You must be a real dick for bullying like an NPC. Oh my god. Where are you going? I don't know. What are we doing? What is, what is the point of my life? What am I doing? This way. This way? Here, I've heard, not 
not sure. Follow the lights. The big flood lights? That's the direction you need to be. Or, or, I will just wander until I find one. Where's that? <laughs> it's like lavender, chamomile, jasmine, but what in the, what? Does any of that work? Do essential oils even work? Uh-oh. I heard they do and it relaxes you. Yeah, but like, I feel like it's placebo. We'd have to do like a, a case study on whether, it, like give it to somebody that doesn't know what it is and see if it relaxes them. Otherwise I won't believe it. Right oh, I, I hear a witch. <gasps> She's right there. She's like, turn your flashlight off. Oh no. Okay. She's in the way. Um, have a shotgun? Witch. Or we could do that. <laughs> oh look, it's dead. Darn. Oh darn. The thing in our way attacked us. Get yourself together, man. You're fine. I didn't attack you, but okay. Yeah, you know what? That you know what that makes me? That makes me a martyr. I saved you. Stress. Oh, Not just okay. you, and I saved it from wow. chat too. That was a jump scare chat. I could have, I could have made that intentionally scary. But I, you know what? Wow. I said, you know what? I'm gonna take that away. I, I don't want you to be scared. Like this is a comforting stream. Oh, still stings like piss. Such a comforting thing. The sound of gunshots. That's right. Is this screamer on? I don't have no clue. I didn't really check. Oh no. Smoke around these parts. He's smoker. There you go. Bill's here. Oh, God. That was gruesome. What are you? Like what are you? <laughs> what is this? He jumps on your back and rides you. It's great. That's why it's a job. Wow. I'm actually kind of into that. It's not consensual though. Like, oh, it's not. But what if I'm I'm consenting now, that right? Is, I Th guess that's therefore we're good. For you, yeah. That's what you want. Oh. Oh, what you're into? Hello, waves of art. Statement. Greetings. Salutations. Uh oh. Oh shit! Watch out! What am I watching out for? See ya. Let's move. Uh, see ya. I love this game. Yeah, this game is pretty is pretty sweet. It actually looks a lot better than I thought it would. Charger. I can't come back. Gotta come down here. Shoot it! Shoot it! Dinner. Wait, are you dead? You're alive. Oh, you're no, good. I'm fine. I'm fine. Oh, yeah. One health point. Oh, how, my God. How have I been? I've been pretty good, Jiggler. My sleep schedule has been really messed up, though, I gotta say. And it's definitely affecting, like, my physical and mental health to some degree. So, tonight we're gonna be taking a melatonin together. You and I, we're doing drugs. Kind of exciting. I haven't really done drugs on stream before. Oh, oh, oh. Another one? Do I hear a witch? I'm not a witch, I'm your wife. <laughs> I killed it. I'm just that good. I just rubbed essential oil on my essential oils for sleep. You know what my first question is, Key? Where? Where, where? where do you put your essential oils on yourself in order to promote sleep? Like on your nose? On your, on your chest? Is it like a, like a vapor oil? Oh 
Watch out! Reloading! Of course. Reload. I used to watch when all you would play is Fortnite. Wait, Fort, Fort, what? Is that a video game? Don't do it, don't do it, don't do it, don't do it. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. The temple of your head, Lavender. Does it really work? <laughs> Maybe it'll work. Imagine if I pressed it early. Just do it. Oh, no. Do it? No, but Tyler, you gotta go fast once he does it. I don't know. I don't know. He's right, telling go. me what to do. Do it! Shut down the carousel. Yeah. Okay. I don't seem to know where to go. Tyler, come here. Where are you? Coming. I think you guys forget how incredible I am as a gamer. I am a, I am a, a crack shot, as they say. A, a hard carry, another might say. Absolutely, I'm incredible. Name a single video game I've ever been bad at. That's right, you can. Oh my god. How dare you guys? You're the anchor? I... That's just definitely not true. You know how hard I used to carry in Fortnite? How did Coach... Wait, wait. How did... How did the NPC deal the most damage? Or get the most kills? He's carrying. Yeah, look at that. Look at Coach go. Witch Hunter, I did the most Garbage. damage to the witch? Wow. Yeah, because you startled her. Mm. Oh, you mean shooting you at it. Oh, I see what you mean. You're, you're saying shooting at the enemy kills it. Wow. Damn, I gotta remember that. You know, it's crazy. I think my dad wanted a boy. Are pills temporary health or are they permanent health? Oh, uh, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Little pick me up. Uh, have a I do. Taking drugs in game and in real life. That's true. Very true. She was already on the door. Getting over it? I'm fantastic at getting over it. <laughs> I've already gotten over it. It's not mad at all. This is this is totally cool. This part. This part is what? Still, it's wholesome. It's a love tunnel. It is a love you tunnel. If I ever played a game with you, I'd be done after 30 minutes. Yeah, because you'd be so bored that I was carrying you the whole time that you'd be like, we should definitely play something else. Reloading. Sounds like a smoker. I'm getting so mad, I can right now. Bro, that tongue, you know? Just, just, just grab me. That was not consensual. Oh. This water don't look natural. Where do, where does water come from, my friend? Any idea? Why are you looking at me like that? Go. Follow them. He's with you. He's protecting Bully and coach again. <laughs> you can't carry me. You don't have any muscles. Uh... He, did you not did you not know that I am by far the most masculine streamer in all of Twitch? I mean look at me. I'm like a living muscle. What is in here? Oh god, what are you Shoot it. That? Shoot oh, it. God. Do it. Don't shoot each other. Nothing happens? Damn. That would have been really cool. I was nervous for a second. I forgot this. Is this a free game? No, it costs ten dollars and a piece of your soul. It goes on sale a lot, though. Halloween. 
masculine, sure, but muscular, no. Have you seen me? I am in perfect physical shape. I'm shaped like a stick. This is my friend. He's my friend. Oh, there's a clown. That's spooky. I love clowns. My entire chat is full of them. Nice voice crack. Don't compliment my crack. You're gonna snap like a stick? Why? What do you mean? What do you mean I'm gonna snap like a stick? Uh, -oh, uh, -oh. uh shotgun? Or wait, 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 wait. Yes. Oh, no. just miss a clue. Right. It's dead. That's right, I killed it. Adrenaline. Let's you perform many actions faster. Oh boy, what kind of actions are we talking here? Gun, gun, gun that, that's a gun? Was this one? Nope, that, that has no ammo. What about this one? What does it do? Holy Weapons moly, we're not doing that one. What, this one? Stop having them. Wait, what does this one do? Holy moly, that's terrible. All right, we're gonna do with this one. What is this? Laser sight upgrade. Oh my god. What is this? Call of, is this Call of Duty? What is this? Open the door. Hello. Bye bye. I miss playing Call of Duty. Me too. I can't wait for a new Call of Duty to come out. I miss, you know, I miss what it felt like when a new Call of Duty would come out. Like nowadays, obviously I'll play the new Call of Duty. But like when I was a kid, like a teenager, and a new Call of Duty would come out, like that would be my whole life. Like, I miss when Left 4 Dead was, like, like a fun game. Like, this game is just... Like, it's fun because I get to play with you guys. I, honestly, if, if I was playing this by myself, I'd be so bored. <laughs> oh, you play with your friends. Yeah, absolutely. Why, he said to do it. I did not say to do it. This is the hardest part of the level. It seems pretty easy to me. That's an excellent idea. Are you familiar with the game Alien Shooter? I don't think so. Bunnies, that's not you. I have no clue what we're doing. Uh, coach. Coach saving the All day. Alright, I bet Dominique. Yeah, definitely post it. Coach saved you? You mean me, who's right behind you. Because I'm an incredible gamer. 
and I fell off. Die. Oh, of course. There you go. Oops, saving the day. That's three times now. Yeah, maybe if Coach was able to revive a little quicker. Healing. Hello, Coding. Hi, how are you doing? Okay. Saved by an NPC, how do you feel? I feel pretty good. I tried. I'm kinda tired. Pretty hungry too, I'm not gonna lie. There's a sandwich that I have. I have a sandwich left in the fridge that I'm really thinking about. It's probably thinking about me too. Reloading. What it what if coach dies, what happens? Oh, we're all fucked. It's it's GG's from there. Bro, you should eat it. You don't even know what's on the sandwich. How do you know it sounds good? It's I literally just called it a sandwich. Bill's here. You already did it. No, it actually is pretty good. <laughs> yes, I <laughs> saved the day. Yeah. Oh, you did it. Look at you go. <laughs> You're so good. What a real gamer. I see a safe house this way. Oh, I would love to go eat that sandwich right now, but instead, I would rather kill some zombies. Everyone in here. All right, everybody's in. We're good. Coach, get in. Bye bye. What's up, Dad? How you doing? How you doing? Look at that. Look, I'm gonna get the most damage on the witch. There it is. <laughs> Look at me go. Look, I told you guys I'm a hard carry. And as, you as literally threw a flaming Molotov at her. Yeah, exactly. I know what I did. I was there. Melee fighter, uh -huh. most kills with a melee weapon. Yeah, who? who gonna go up. Who uses melee weapons? Oh, the cool. Come people. on. Buddy guitar, come on. I was being supportive. Yeah, you are being supportive. You know what, Gabby? I really appreciate that. I'm glad you were uh, gone for two months saving turtles to come back to tell me to eat a sandwich. Thanks, Gabby. You know what really tastes good? Tyler. Turtles. Have you ever actually had turtle soup? Either of you? No, gosh. Really? I haven't either, but I heard it Wait, tastes have, really good. Have you? No, I haven't. I would love to though. If somebody was like, I just made some turtle soup, would you like that? I'd be like, hell yes, let's go. Maybe like once, just to say I've done it and then Well, I'm what they call a foodie. So uh, I only eat like, you know, like really good food. That's met. They're endangered. Are they really? Well, then I guess maybe I won't be eating turtle anytime soon. I see. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. Yeah, I don't want you guys to hate me. Whoa, this clown is crazy. Good night, Key. I will not be saying that, Key. I have a pet turtle. They are very gentle creatures. They're probably very delicious. Oh, thank. I bet you Lily tastes pretty good. She's plump, you know? She's got a lot of meat on her bones. You're a terrible person. Oh, I'm sorry, I enjoy good food. I'm, a, I'm what they call a foodie. Don't forget that. It's a pipe bomb. That's the worst place to get under.
There, oh, there is, there is this, uh, Korean, Korean supermarket that I've been to that's in the area that does sell live turtles. And every time I see it, I feel so bad. Anytime I see, like, a live animal being sold, like, to be eaten, I'm always like, I want to release you. I bet you, you taste good enough to eat, but no one is suggesting that. Probably. I mean, look at me. I probably... I, maybe not, though, because I have a lot of muscle, you know? And muscle's pretty mean and kind of hard to chew. I don't like my sense of humor, honestly. Amy and hard to chew. Wonderful aim there. I hear a witch crying. Kill your life. It worked. They're dead. Wait, I hear a witch. Uh, heal coach. Actually make me heal coach. That is not happening. Our MVP. Is that, is that, what, what does that mean? Healing. Most valuable, valuable player. player. Oh, okay. I don't see the witch. I heard the witch. All good now. You want to know where the witch is? It's like somewhere over here. Yeah, because it's can't hear it over here. Uh, that's for later, yeah. Yeah, that's. Wait, 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 wait. One of my advisors over there ate turtle soup at a place we went, and he got told off by our supervisor. Okay, I think that if you're the entire point of going on a trip, right, is to save the turtles, and then on the same trip you end up eating a turtle, I think you kind of deserve it. Like, <laughs> it feels a little counterproductive, no? We ragged on him. These pants. Yeah, I would too. I would too. A sword? I don't want a sword. Oh, sh sh you broke your knees. <laughs> I'll break your knees. What is the uh -huh. point? What's the point of me? Make you make make you make me <laughs> break your knees. Boomer sneaking around. Boomer. That would be you, Bunny, right? I'm talking about you. <laughs> You're older than me, right? You're like... Ah, balls. What is this? We got Molotovs. I do very much enjoy how there are these just random weapons laying around for us to use. This is America. It is, <laughs> yeah, that is some good logic. You're you're not wrong. Oh, I can snipe things. Thank God, there's not hundreds Everybody of zombies to kill. Why would they? What? This gun is terrible. That's why we're gonna use it. I'm gonna trick shot all of them. We're gonna quick. We're gonna be right. quick scoping zombies. We're seeing that. Careful on these roofs. 360 no scope. Incoming. Hit that guy. There's a spitter over there. Where? Oh, never mind. This yo got him. Smoker. Where are you living right now? In an apartment. Oh, you want my address? Yeah, let me just dox myself real quickly. Yeah. 360. 720. 360. 
I'm so good. Oh, thank you, Gabby. I appreciate that. I appreciate that. I'm glad you enjoyed your vacation, Gabby. If anybody in chat wants to say hello to them, please do say hello. Oh lord. I am on fire. Oh, the gas can of this. That I definitely did not shoot, because that would be a bad idea. Oh. Oh, go just take it. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Why did they... Oh, we... It's the time to run. Uh oh. Why did they give me a sniper rifle? There are hundreds of zombies. I got this one. Hey, you want. What do you mean we're not gonna? Not with that attitude. I mean, I have a freaking sniper rifle. I I get you out. That's right. I'm you reviving you, Is Was that good? Oh yeah. Thanks, coach. Oh my god. Another hunter. That's a wish. Oh shit. That's what we call it, uh, a clutch carry. Oh, so he goes dead. Yeah, just uh, like coach died. Should we let coach die? Will he respond? Alright, coach. I got you, bud. I got- oh shit. Oh shit, I got the bomb. There we go. Ooh. I'm incredible. Hey chat. Chat, g give me a compliment, please. I'm, I'm itching. Anybody, any compliment. Minor, big. Did most Ooh. damage stuff. Look at that. Me and Bunnies carried that witch. Right. Nice Yo, sweater. Oh, thank you. Y'all yeah. know the midnight ride. Thanks, Gabby. They're gonna save us. Coach, I hate to break it to you, but I don't think they're actually here. We start their finale. That chopper is gonna Can know die. something's up because nobody. I can't let Coach die. Oh, that? Okay, fine. 
We'll put on the finale light show. These the zombies best better be part. ready to rock. Uh, this is a good one. I've actually, you know what's funny? I've actually seen the speed run of this level too. You ready to get it on? I actually know how to do this last part. I think. All right, then let's see it. Uh, you, I don't think you could do Let's it with go. this many people. I think you can only do it, you have to kill your teammates. That's like the first step. Oh. Yeah. And I don't get, like the speed run idea anymore. I mean, I, I, I think it's a great idea. I think we should definitely try it. Apparently, the end of this level, the speed run is, okay, like, kind of random. There's a little bit of RNG involved. Yep. It's because of the tanks I built. Can we not shoot each other? Hi, Strawberry Kisses. Greetings and salutations. Hello, kicking. Yeah, by the way, if you guys are not following me on Twitter, Instagram, YouTube, Discord, I'd really appreciate it. If you find me on Tinder, give me a super like. Reloading. Yeah, so if I remember correctly. I don't know if I 100% remember. Uh -oh. oh, maybe not. I don't know. Oh, it's a TO. Oh, you. Wow, that was what good. That was pretty good. Great time to start. The spitter brought me to an edge and it immediately knocked me. That's kind of cool. Thanks, bro. Reloading. Do you reimburse people for super likes? What do you mean they're free? Oh, are we not supposed to? What do you mean? I don't even know how I would reimburse you. Hello, Wakefoot. Greetings. If you guys want me to say hi to you, please say hi. We are currently. Oh. oh no. I could have handled it on my own, okay, bunnies? Alright. Coach's life was in my hands. I you had to pay for those? No, you get like one a day or something. Uh... Oh. Ah, oh, shh. Look at Coach go. The actual carry. Thanks, Coach. Stay safe, I'm up here. Oh, once again! Oh, that tongue. Not ready for it. It's gonna happen again. I can feel it. 
because I'm gonna let it happen. I need ammo. Is this set in Canada? No, no, where, where? Is this, uh, Georgia? Georgia. That makes sense. That definitely makes sense. Goodbye, coach. It was really nice knowing you. Oh, God. say a joke is kind of dark but funny. I guess it really depends on how funny it is and how dark it is. No, I guess I'm if not funny, you're banned. Yeah, there we go. That's a good rule. Killed a boomer. Oh, 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 oh. I hope Coach survives this part. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, God. Man, rip. What's up, Cheeky? Hi, it's been a minute. How are you doing? Uh, that's not. That was pretty bad, I'm not gonna lie. Zero deaths. That's right, let me go. Number of times, in don't look at that one. Uh... <laughs> yeah. Oh, awesome. That was fun. It's been a minute. That was dope. Oh, I'm I can- so I can- I'm y'all survived. All right, good game. Yeah, it's way past your bedtime. Yeah. <laughs> when do you normally sleep? <laughs> Midnight. Oh, oh boy. <laughs> wow. You stayed up for me. Very kind of you. No, it was oh, for me. For bunnies, actually. <laughs> uh, for bunnies. I see, I see. Okay, fair enough. Well, thank you for playing anyway. I appreciate it. Good night. Good night. This is Matt Ty, and thanks for playing. This was... Of course, Wonderful. bunnies. We we can we can, we can try to play in the future too. I think this would be a fun, like a, like a I don't know what to call it, but this is definitely like a fun friend game, because it's just like a, you just kind of mess around. I'm kind of surprised that we played it on easy mode though. I was kind of expecting for us to go into like a veteran difficulty. To next time. Next, I I'm definitely down. The next time we play this, we will up the difficulty. There's so. also a new level that came out last Halloween. A new level to a 12-year-old yep. game? Yeah, so that'd be fun to play on an extreme. Is it is it DLC, or is it already here? It's for free. You probably already have it. Oh, bet. That's awesome. Yeah, I'm definitely down. Uh, thanks, for, thanks for the invite. I appreciate it. Yeah. Um... All right, I'm going to take a melatonin, and we're going to see what happens. All right, see you in chat. Go goodbye. <laughs> Actually, I'm kind of surprised that we didn't end up playing another one. Uh...
the I am really tired though. So I think I think we we definitely I definitely should try to take a melatonin and see what happens. Yeah, we're about to we're, we're gonna do some drugs together, you and I, alright? Um I have to get myself back into a vibe of wanting to sleep. Cause like I'm tired, but like I can guarantee that if I were to end the stream, that I like would not be ready for sleep. So I need to like really get myself amped and ready to go to bed. So can I take two extra strength melatonin or would that be very bad for me? Where is the lid? There it is. Hi, everybody. Hello. I am not an expert, but I'd say not good. What are the milligrams? Uh, these are 10 milligrams, which doesn't really feel like a lot, but it does say extra strength on the bottle, which leads me to believe that you really don't need very much melatonin to uh, get things going. I also have no water either. I do have a very, very sleepy kitty who is currently laying down. If you guys would be interested in seeing her. <gasps> Look at her. That is how I want to be in the next half hour. She is so damn cute right now. She is so damn cute. She is very comfy. My computer is very warm. I can feel the heat from here. So. She's so damn cute. Oh my god! Chat, what have I done to myself and my body? I say coming back for Lily only. That's fair. I assume a majority of you sub anyway, because you want Lily. I assume. You know? Which is totally understandable. I... Lily provides a level of comfort that I strive to achieve. They're a sleeping animal, especially a sleeping cat, is a very comfy symbol. You guys can agree or disagree, but like I see a sleepy kitty and I'm like, that is adorable. Top level, makes me sleep. All right, uh, I should probably go get some water then for this melatonin, and we're gonna see what happens. I really don't want to get up. All right, I'll be right back. I'm gonna go get myself a glass of water, which I probably need. I'm pretty, pretty thirsty, you know. Thank you. 
did you miss me? Oh, hi chat. Greetings and salutations. Tell me something interesting. Somebody tell me a fun fact. I'm really in the mood to learn. You miss me dearly. Oh, thank you, Cheryl. Thank you, thank you. And bottoms up, by the way. Cheers. This really... I guess if I didn't tell you it was melatonin, you wouldn't really know what it was. It could be pretty much anything, so... Let's pretend it's melatonin. Uh, I forgot to do my homework, and I'm doing it all today. It's due today. Is it any kind of homework that I can help you with? For some weird reason, I get an enjoy- uh, and a level of enjoyment out of helping other people, like people in my chat, doing their homework. I think it's because the responsibility of whether it's right or wrong, and the grade that follows it, is not on me. So, if there's an amount of it, Dominique, that I can help you with, I'm down. Let's go for it. I got into a love triangle on accident. Explain. To explain, explain your love triangle. I explain this, what is this thing called love? What is that? Is there a definition for that one? Nah, I can do it myself, thanks for the offer. That's not what I said, Dominique. I, I said you send it to me. And I'm gonna do it. There's no... There's no... Th there's no negotiation. You're gonna do it. <laughs> in Canada, we get our milk in bags. That's the most local fact I have. I feel like liquid in any bag is just not the right way of being able to receive liquid, unless it's through an IV. But, you know, to each their own, I guess. Do you want to do my AP government homework? Very fun. Yeah, send it to me. Send it to me on Discord and I'll take a look at it. I don't have any pro no promises that I will actually do it and complete it, but like, send it to me anyway. I'll take a look. Why not? What's the worst that happens? I do it, and then you fail, and then you have to drop out? Join the circus? Become a clown? I mean, you already are. You don't really need to become. Hi, Mimi. Greetings. Why would you say that? What do you mean? I'm trying to manifest it. Hi, Tori. Tell that to my high school that gave us a bag, bag of juice. Bag of juice. Like this? Is this what they gave you? so weird yeah like the capri sun like i get but the capri sun the way that the capri sun is structured right it's structured to have a bottom so it can stand up on its own a bag cannot stand up on its own you have to hold it the entire time i'll use variables to make it less confusing my best friend and i like the same girl whose best friend I've been friends with for years and she likes my best friend. Okay. So when when is the confession of of interest coming? Is anybody actually going to tell each other that they like each other or is this just going to be like a constant state of not knowing? What part of the body always loses defeat? That's a good one. That is, uh, 
Uh, that is a uh, you don't you don't get a ha ha, but you get you get a smile. So that's pretty good. I was it was a school that could afford a twenty thousand dollar bronze sculpture of our mascot, but not even juice and cartons. <laughs> we used to get juice in like these um these like plastic uh these I, I i can't i can't really explain it i have to i have to see if i can find a picture of it school school juice oh there we go yeah these these are the juice containers that we used to get our juice out of like these it's like plastic on the bottom not these ones but they kind of look like this they were okay the main complaint that i always had is that the school's uh refrigerators or whatever were too cold and then it would be frozen so it'd be more like a popsicle but i you know what you know it's kind of weird is it is it weird that i miss school lunch to like a degree like i kind of miss okay school lunches we can probably mutually all agree that school lunch is pretty bad middle school high school the pizza the burgers whatever like it's they're not great but there's something about the the level of expectation and what i what i what i like maybe it's the fondness that i have for school cafeteria burgers or like school pizza but sometimes i actually crave that bad quality food like sometimes i'm just like damn i wish i had some pizza dippers and a chocolate milk oh. but i'm leaving for school in new york in like a week Oh, I see. I understand, Cheryl. Be best to not get yourself involved in any any love triangles. <laughs> That's like that is a great username. That is that is a really good username. I, I legit I legit miss school lunches. My high school was also pretty pretty awesome when it came to school lunches so the way that my high school worked is that every person everybody in the school had lunch at the same exact time every every grade every everybody had lunch at the same time for like 53 minutes i think was the total and if you were a senior you were allowed to leave school to go get lunch on your own and you had to make it back to class but everybody else was allowed to wander the school and there were many different stations throughout the hallways that had different kinds of food so the main cafeteria sold burgers pizza you know all that uh, i think they sold nachos like those were like an everyday thing you can get a burger you can get a chicken patty you get nachos every single day and then around the school, there were like sandwich carts that had different snacks and stuff on them. It was really, my high school was great. I have no complaints about the school lunches. So maybe I have some really good fond memories of my high school and the food they used to serve. It was pretty bougie. I actually wonder, is there any possible way that my high school would allow me to get lunch, even though I no longer go to high school there? I mean, it's kind of like, <laughs> I kind of graduated like 20 years ago or something, but if I just like walked in and was like, hey, I'm interested, I'm an alumni, and I'm interested in purchasing a school lunch, would you guys sell it to me? Would they do it? Do you think they would? That's weird. Is it weird? I guess it is a little weird. Maybe I'm a little too comfortable. The chocolate milk of my school cafeteria was top notch. Top tier, yeah. 
Mine was pretty good too. I don't I don't know the brand or anything, but that's my bedtime story. I did enjoy it, Cheryl. I did. Every, the the biggest comment about these school lunches is apparently you guys like the chocolate milk, which I totally understand. My high school looked like a Save by the Bell cafeteria. Oh, that's funny. That's kind of funny. See, my high school is more like some people buy lunch and some people bring their own lunch. The table's outside. Oh, that is so cool. I wish that we were able to like sit outside and eat. That would definitely have uh, made things really interesting. I know that there was this little courtyard area that was in between some of the classrooms that we always wanted to sit at, but I don't think they allowed us. I don't think our my school trusted us enough to not like hide things or people in very odd locations of the school. I don't know. <laughs> I really don't get it. But I remember all of the cool kids all of the cool kids would eat their lunch in the in the gym so the gym was uh kind of sort of off limits if you were part of the popular the popular group i don't know why it's not really like a good it's not even like a good location to eat lunch there's no tables or anything i never really understood that one I think they'd arrest you for what? Oh, you think? Oh, you think my school would arrest me if I asked if I could purchase a school lunch from them? Yeah, it probably wouldn't end very well. You know, it's kind of interesting too. My high school reunion, ten-year high school reunion, is coming up in three years, 2014. I have no clue if I'm actually gonna attend or not. Probably not. I don't know. Like, I was kind of happy to, like, have graduated from school. And the idea of going back for fun. <laughs> I don't know how fun that is. The lunch ladies would put you under arrest. Yeah, the, the lunch ladies would pretty much do nothing. I... I remember, I remember being in drama club. And after school, when drama club would take place... My classmates that were in drama club with me we would actually go into the school's cafeteria and act like we had special permission because we were getting permission from the drama club leaders, like the teachers. When in reality, we had no permission and we had no obligation of being there. Like we should not have been there, but they allowed us to. And we kind of just ran with it. So like we would talk with the lunch people all the time and they were very cool, but there is no chance in which any lunch lady or lunch person would put me under a citizen's arrest. It would just not happen. If you live in New York City, by then you should flex on them. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see. You can get lunch during your tenure. I don't think they're gonna hold the ten-year high school reunion in the calf in like the school. I would assume that they would do it in like a hotel, maybe, because. Okay, if there is not an open bar at my 10 year high school reunion there is pretty much a zero percent chance that i end up going that is just that is just locked in stone if there is no chance that there's alcohol being served i why would why would i want to go that's kind of funny cup it's kind of funny Hello, gay boy. Greetings. Salutations. By the way, hi, everybody that is new. For anybody that doesn't know who I am, my name is Tyler. I stream. You should follow me. Social media. Really appreciate it. Uh, how many people from high school are you still in touch with? Like, besides my friends, like, besides, like, my close friends that I still talk with. Like, uh, you guys know Schwartz, who's one of my mods here as well as you guys kind of know savage value who comes by both of which have been on stream they are both from my high school they are like my high school friends in terms of other people outside of them not many very people not many people <laughs> uh when i return home to new jersey there's like a moderate level of 
chance that I might see somebody from my high school, but you like jazz. I'm not gonna lie. I really don't want to be affiliating with people from my high school. Not that my high school had bad people, but part of my personal growth and journey was escaping the hometown that I was living in for a majority of my life. So returning home to see these people that I was trying to essentially escape is pretty counterproductive to my life plans. Exactly, Cheryl, exactly. Wouldn't it be awkward to have a whole new staff hold the reunion? That's a good question. A little bit. I've definitely changed too much. That is that is true. I've definitely changed quite a lot since high school. Uh, I'm kind of bored. What, 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 what's the, what's the border between bored and then like not bored? Like you're in the middle, right? You like jazz. You know, you could just ignore them, right? Learn Kung Fu to beat them up. Actually, uh, martial arts are used for self-defense and self-defense only. So you would be ignoring the entire point of Kung Fu. What's up, Ash? Ashley. What's up, Ashley? Same mistakes. I'm glad you like the setup. I'm, uh, I'm, I'm quite pleased. I like the setup quite a lot too. It's very comfy. Feels, it feels very at home for me. We got some lights going on. We got a nice little background view. I mean, look at that. That's dope. What if I went for you and just be like, yeah, I'm Tyler. I'm hella short now. <laughs> Are you kind of funny? I don't, I don't know if you'd be able to pass off as a me, you know? I... If I was dating like a celebrity, then like I would contemplate going to my my high school reunion. I think that'd be kind of cool. I also wonder how many people from my high school have like made it, you know, like how many people are now celebrities like living the high life. At least one or two. I know at least one person from my high school that is is like Instagram famous, like four million followers Instagram famous, I think. Hi, you clown. I came from the unicycles. I'm kind of disappointed. Oh, you mean the conversation that went on like a day ago? <laughs> yeah, you've already missed the raffle on that one. It is currently almost 2 a.m. for me, Holix. Bring Pokey as your date. If I had the opportunity to, I would, but like that's just not really going to happen. I, I don't know in what situation I would be able to present like... How would I even get myself into a position where I could ask and, and, and talking about it on stream? Now I'm just ruining it. When I become partner, that is true. I guess when I'm partnered, that would definitely make my opportunities slightly easier to come by. Oh no. Oh my god. Yeah, Ash, you, you gotta early bird, you know? You gotta be here. Still shook I have the VIP badge. All right, I'll take it away then. That's fine. Would you like me to remove the VIP? None of this conversation, Pokey will never know, hopefully. I'm a busy bird, I know, I know. With your journalism, look at you go. Look at you go, and in, in another, in another parallel universe i became a journalist and used my journalism degree for an actual reason but that's like a whole nother universe that i don't even want to contemplate hello juicy jesus greetings and salutations how are you doing watch rami and michelle's high school reunion before heading to a high school reunion yeah, i have no clue what that is i have seen always sunny in philadelphia and that high school reunion two-parter and that is pretty much how i picture high school reunions to be i also watched this video of this guy that hired somebody to go to his high school reunion as him which was very interesting 
Oh, so you have taste? Why? Because I like Always Sunny. That's a good show. I think it's funny. I love your lilac colored sweater. I think it's pink, but you might be right. There's a lot of purple lights going on right now. Also, holy moly, that melatonin. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm about to get loopy. I haven't watched you in a minute. Oh, no, no worries. The follow age doesn't really work, I don't think, anyway. So, I am literally about to KO. Check DMs when you can. Nothing bad, don't worry. Gabby wants to send you her homework. So you can, so you can maybe, but, yeah. oh. Dope. I'm 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 definitely down. We're going to we're going to actually get somebody's homework to do on stream. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm more curious as to how I can How are you with poems? My, my, in my undergrad, my minor was in creative writing, in which all of the creative writing classes that I took were poetry classes, including uh, a 400 level poetry class. So, not to brag, but I'd say it's pretty okay. Oh, no worries, Ashley. I appreciate you being here. Thank you for coming by and saying hello. 400 levels of poetry. Yeah, 400 levels. Yeah, exactly. Oh my god, my stomach is not liking this melatonin. Gabby, you gotta send me your homework so we can do it. Yeah, pretty much, Bunny. Show this stream, I might be able to help. That's exactly what I plan on doing. But we actually got to be sent the homework first, so I can take a look. Are you seriously, genuinely going to help me if I send it to you? How disappointed would you be, Dominique, if you sent me your homework, expecting me to help you, and then I just chose to not help you? Would you be... Would all of your dreams be crushed? Oh, here we go. Gabby actually sent this to me. I posted this in the Discord initially, but I realized I had it on... Okay, okay. So this is a Google Docs. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. So this is... Uh... So this is Gabby's homework. Let's take a look. AP US Government and Politics Summer Media Assignment due Monday, September 13th. Oh, you have forever to do this. Why are we doing this now? I would literally be doing this on Sunday. <laughs> Mon Sunday, September 12th. This assignment asks you to track the media's coverage of one aspect of U.S. government and politics in the past, in the three weeks leading up to our first meeting. Oh, I mean, I literally have a journalism degree, so this will this will definitely uh, I'll carry you for this one. Choose a topic or focus from the list on the following page. Select three following media outlets and track their coverage of your chosen topic. Choose pieces that are both long form and short, written audio, conservative, and liberal. Well, you know what's kind of funny too? You know, you know, you know what's slightly funny about this? Is that something that we learn in in journalism is that media in order for in order for journalism to be proper journalism, it needs to be as unbiased as possible. Liberal and conservative happens, and it's really hard to not put a twist on media. But the fact that it's like, 
it like has just sacrificed it to like, yeah, it's going to be one way or the other. It's kind of funny, at least to me. I'm laughing on the inside. Uh, over the course of three weeks, read and listen to five podcasts per week. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm not doing this. I'm not gonna lie. You're not my dad. Yo, Phil. Yeah, he love you, Ty. Two hearts. Hey, I appreciate it. Thank you for the ten months, Phil. Welcome back. Good morning, M Mix Mixia. How I don't know how to pronounce your name. Yeah, I'm definitely not doing this. Once you've written your ten analyses, is that a, is that a correct word? Anal. Anal Wysis. Oh, yeah. I guess so. Fair enough. Write a one to two page typed reflection in a Google Doc. Be sure to follow all these instructions to the letter. Jeez. They, re they really didn't need to throw that in at the end. <laughs> like, like you were gonna stop following the instructions given to you. To the letter. For the love of God. You're... <laughs> yeah, one to two pages is literally nothing. I, I, I would write one to two pages in 20 minutes. <laughs> so. Yeah, no, this teacher does seem very aggressive. I do agree with you. I do agree with you. Hello, Lemon. Greetings. What's happening right now? I'm looking at other people's homework and then deciding if I have the ability of doing it. And then if I can do it, I'll help them. And if not, then I'll just choose not to. If anybody has homework that they need to be done, that needs to be done, by all means, send it to me. I'll look at it right now and I'll help you if I can. I just really enjoy helping others, you know? I just, I'm just, I'm a man of the people. How is your melatonin tummy? My stomach kind of hurts, I'm not gonna lie. I'm also pretty hungry, and I have a sandwich in the fridge that I'm kind of craving that I definitely want to eat right now. Should I go get that? Should I go? Should I eat a sandwich on stream? How embarrassing! Yeah, I think we go do it. Full send. Yeah, I'm about to. Very appreciate your outlook for how much you helped me. Let me see. Let me see if I can actually help you to any degree. Like looking at the looking at this assignment. At what degree can I help you? Select three of the following media outlets listed and track their coverage of your chosen topic. Okay, from what I know, the New York Times you have to pay for. So I, even though I like the New York Times personally, you have to pay like a you have to pay a certain amount in order to get access to their articles. So that's it. That's all I got. That's a very moderate level of help. So, but that's better than nothing. It's better than nothing change to food category yeah maybe you're right i didn't know that did you really not know that are you are you being serious or did i actually help you just install the extension that removes the paywall or 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 don't just drop out of school I, you know what? I don't feel pity for anybody that chooses to take an AP class. I really don't. It, my AP classes were absolutely miserable in high school. I did not enjoy them to one, to, to one bit. So. Uh, I took, I took a total of three AP courses in my high school career. I took AP Human Geography which was an absolute joke of a course uh the professor was very very the professor the teacher we have to go back to grade school the teacher was very nice in fact she reminded me a lot of phoebe from friends like her personality you know uh i took and on that ap exam i got a two out of five meaning i literally wasted money for nothing the other AP courses I took, I took computer science, which I pretty much 
cheated the entire time and just copied other people's code. Didn't really have the motivation to, uh... And then I... I needed a GPA booster. So, the way that my school worked... Uh, you also cheated? Yeah, bro. We, I just, like, looked at the people next to me and looked at their code and just copied it. <laughs> I was all... I also had, like, a friend in the course who, like, we would, like, help each other out. But the way that my school worked was that depending on the level of course that you took, increased or decreased your GPA. So AP level courses were weighted very, very highly. So if you did very well in an AP course, uh, you were given a higher GPA based off of that. And my GPA wasn't particularly great. And the only way that you could get AP credit was if you took the AP exam. And I was not doing very well. And I also didn't know very much of AP computer science because I was pretty much cheating the entire time instead of paying attention. So I signed up for the AP exam, which is like $70 or something. And I looked at the exam and knew I was going to fail so hard that I fell asleep during the middle of the exam. Woke back up like an hour later, turned in my AP exam completely blank with just my name on it. Uh, and then my parents were so mad. They were like, oh, you're gonna have to pay the $70. And I'm like, oh darn. But then my GPA was boosted. So I guess mission accomplished. <laughs> I took chemistry online and totally cheated the whole time. Oh, I cheated a lot throughout my 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 middle school and high school career. There It's kind of a shame that I did that I did cheat the entire time during grade school because I feel like there was more of a pressure to do well than there was on actually learning the material. Which is kind of a shame. Like, I'm sure I could have learned something really cool if I didn't have to worry about whether I was gonna fail or pass. Or, you know? Like, right now, in my, I'm currently in grad school studying therapy. I love the material that I'm learning. I like really enjoy the classes that I have. I mean, some of them are kind of crap, but obviously I care about the grade because my GPA is very high, but there's so much more emphasis on learning. Oh, I am done. This melatonin right now, I cannot hold on for very long. I'm just letting you guys know now. I, I am slipping. <laughs> I am slowly slipping. Oh, AP. Oh, and the other AP class that I took was AP Psychology, which I also cheated on. Uh, however, it was a very interesting course, and I'm very glad that I took it. I feel that, Dominique. Yeah, I just say drop out, honestly. Quick sandwich, then bedtime. I think that I'm going to start off the night by, by, by signing off, because... <laughs> I can feel delirium coming <laughs> i'm gonna start i'm gonna start to I, I, i'm gonna get the giggles if i continue <laughs> i can't do this i can't i can't, I can't. <laughs> oh i need to chill <laughs> Why am I laughing? There's like nothing going on. <laughs> uh, <laughs> drop out and start your own business. Yeah. It's kind of what I did. Not, not really. That's not really what I did at all. I'm just tired and I'm agreeing with you because I can't really think. All right. It is sleepy time. Sleepy, sleepy bedtime. Uh, I'm going to do uh, the end of my wrap up. By the way, if you guys are new here and you guys don't know who I am, my name is Tyler. I'm a full-time variety streamer. I mostly do just chatting. Uh, I'm in grad school to become a therapist. And I'm going to bed because I took a 
extra strength melatonin and i am being slaughtered by it it is taking the reins it is taking the reins thank you thank you names i appreciate it oh thank you bunnies i appreciate you uh you su your suggestion i had a lot of fun i thought it was a good time i hope you guys enjoyed left for dead as well it's been a really long time since i played that game i'm sorry we didn't get to play very much of it i feel like we should play another one but right now i am dying so starting from the very beginning uh our donation of what oh my like god i can't speak words what are words right now fill with the two months and thank you to follow talon i appreciate it yeah i'm dying right now i'm gonna go grab the sandwich from my fridge and then hopefully not fall asleep mid eating it because that end <laughs> that could end very badly i could die so i love you very much i hope you guys had a fun oh you like my follow alert thank you i hope you guys had a fun night for anybody that does not know uh, i do not stream on wednesdays and sundays so I will not be streaming tomorrow, but if you'd like to come by on Thursday, Thursday I will be streaming. Uh, if I do stream tomorrow, actually, I don't really think I'm, it depends on when I wake up. Tomorrow I'm going out to a karaoke bar with my sister and my mother, who I have not seen in at least a month. So I'm really looking forward to that. I'm hoping I can get some good sleep. So I love you. Thank you for being here. Please, please, if you're not already, follow me on social media, on Twitter, Instagram, YouTube, Discord, uh, Tinder. I'd really appreciate it if you did. We have the same name. Is your name also Tyler? That's awesome. There's probably a, an, another, or two, you know, another few Tylers sprinkled throughout the stream that just don't want to admit it. It's a pretty killer name. All right, all. I am I am falling asleep. I'm going to turn on the goodbye sugar. Uh, this is a way for you guys to say goodnight to me and everyone else in stream. On channel point, please feel free to spam it. X cool aunt. I have no clue if she's in Florida. However, she I will I will see if she has the invite. I love you. Thank you for coming out and watching stream today. I really do appreciate you. We are currently on a partner push. So every day, you guys are making that closer and closer to a reality. Hi, Gabby. I love you all. I'll be back on on Thursday at around 11 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And until next time, until next time, go get some really good and beneficial beauty sleep. Like, I'm about to go get. Actually, I'm about to go get a sandwich first. That's... That is, that is the first on my priority list is that sandwich. Goodbye. I love you. I'll see you guys on Thursday. Bye-bye.